Progress is inevitable type. The hopeful for a cure type. The type that will stop at nothing until type one becomes type none. Last year at OC Fashion Week, we got to honor and introduce the world of fashion photography. And what was so incredible was we were able to discover the most amazing photographers, even beyond the runway. So let's take a look back at Orange County Fashion Week at the first winner of the world of fashion photography. Last year's winners were Dawn Michelle Nash, known for her epic new model discoveries, garnered the New Discovery Award. George Arguelles, who captured the couture essence in his images displayed and won the Deeper Beauty Award. And the winner of the World of Fashion Photography and International Winner of 2015 Award, Victoria Pashuta. And we were in awe of Victoria Pashuta's amazing talents. I mean, look at the incredible colors. And, and we have really come to appreciate here at OC Fashion Week, the world of these photographers and the eyes that they are behind the fashion. From Victoria Pashuta to George Arguelles to Dawn Nash, just incredible. So today, we get to go behind the scenes and check out last year's winner, Victoria Pashuta, because we here she is launching a brand new magazine. Victoria Pashuta is starting her new magazine. And we hear the magazine is called Basic. Come check it out. Hey Victoria, so great to see you behind the scenes. I know last time we saw you on Fashion East Snapboarding, you were in front of the camera. We switched seats. So tell me, what are you up to? Hi Ali, I'm really good, nice and shiny here in California. How's it over there? We're so excited to check out your shoot and what you're doing with your new magazine. Hey, yeah, there's been lots of things going on, very exciting uh, projects and things coming along. I just always wanted to have my own magazine. Even like from age 11, I had the full collection of Vogue, Vogue Harper's Bazaar, um, all the independent little fashion magazines that I would find in different countries. And even still at home, I have a huge stack of different magazines like dating 1992, 1995, and I never threw them away. So I was always passionate. I feel like that also uh, triggered my, um, my interest in photography in the first place. So when I had this opportunity right now where I I, where I tried pretty much everything in photography. I tried fashion films and said, okay, what's next? Because I never stop. And I felt like magazine would be a natural extension to my, um, my passion for photography. Um, year 2015 has been really amazing for me. I had so many adventures and projects um, in terms of photography and fashion films. And after winning uh, Pond Demonium, um, at OC Fashion Week, lots of great things happened to me. I 
had an opportunity to go to Cape Town, South Africa, Mercedes-Benz, Boca Fashion Film Festival and present um, a fashion film, um, Kiss of a Siren, where um, amongst of the world's top um, fashion filmmak filmmakers and directors, we um, unexpectedly and surprisingly won the Best Picture Award, uh, which is, was super prestigious and really blew, blew our minds because this is the second fashion film I actually did in my career and the second film won the Best Picture, uh, competing with such directors as Bruna Velian, who shot Cartier uh, films and Chanel, and it was amazing even to be on the same uh, on the same level as him and actually beat him. So that was super exciting that um, our little film made such a big impact on people. And it was surprising that after that I was approached by a actress and um, singer Tisha Campbell Martin who really was blown away by the film and she asked me to do a music video for her and I ended up directing um, a music video called Still Here that um, got like one million uh, views on YouTube and Vimeo and I was super um, I was super excited because this was actually the first official music video I directed and um, it was it was quite an experience and I feel like um, all projects helped me to endeavor my future uh, uh, my future adventures and future things and you know and other different projects that I, that I have in mind forever. By the way, Ali, we're having a basic magazine launch party, February 19th. You're super welcome to come, uh, party with us, check out the magazine, um, have, you know, um, grace yourself, you know, uh, your outfits on the red carpet, and cannot wait to finally see you in person. Well, we so much enjoyed visiting with you, Victoria, and thank you for having us behind the scenes because your set is so incredible. And are you going to be joining us at OC Fashion Week? Yes, it's actually a huge honor for me to come this year, um, not as a, as a competitor, but one of the judges, and to um, give my point of view on the artists and photographers who will be exhibiting and presenting their works this year, uh, World of Fashion Photography. This is very exciting because every year the trends and things are changing. It's always exciting to see what photographers are coming up with and showing and sharing their vision with the rest of them. So. Um, I would love to see new works and possibly feature some of the best ones in the new issue of Basic Magazine and scout new talent and um, see if there are any unique new visions out there um, because that's what Mag Basic Magazine stands for. Well, we so much enjoyed visiting with you, Victoria, and thank you for having us behind the scenes because your set is so incredible. Well, we're so excited to have you come back and this time as a judge at the World of Fashion Photography Awards of OC 2016. Of course, I cannot wait for the um, Orange County Fashion Week and see you there and, you know, have a couple of twerking uh, sessions going on together <laughs> and have fun. So, um, see you soon. I'm Allie Levine and we'll be right back.